Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make your batch code into an executable. And this has two perks. If it's an actual program that's legitimate, then it makes it look more uh, non-malicious. If it's a virus, then it makes it harder to figure out what it is. It makes it harder to get rid of, too. Anyway, you'll have to download a bat to EHC converter or just an EHC converter and you'll find what you're going to change to EHC in this case you know it's going to be a batch file click on that and if it's a real program you can go ahead and make it visible but if you're trying to make it you know a virus you hit invisible application and then you can leave all this alone unless you want it to you know do that uh, I would, if it is a virus, I might get r not delete temporary files, but I probably would. So it just makes it harder to detect and it cleans its trail. Hit compile. Voila, it's right here. So there you go. That's how you do that. I'll put a link to this or another one that I like more in the description box below. And I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I do making these videos for you guys. Have a good day and happy Thanksgiving. Bye.